Hey Royals, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Liz, aka Royal Beauty, and today we have a new wig. I'm super hyped because this is a wig that I truly, truly believe I manifested because I really wanted a wig like this, so I'm excited to share it with you. It is from Yiru Wigs on Amazon. Yiru is not, yeah. Anyway, they're a company that sells wigs. I don't know if they're Yiru Wigs, but they sell wigs like this beautiful curly one here. Y'all, this wig looks so natural. I was so stoked when they hit me up and asked me to review it for them. So I'm getting ready to show it to you guys. So the inside of it is like this. It is a full cap wig. It does not have any combs whatsoever. Just an adjustable strap. Hopefully I show you. Where's the adjustable strap? Show them the adjustable strap. Are you going to show them? Yes, you are. There you go. There you go. Adjustable strap. Yes, it's an adjustable strap wig. That's it. Very, very comfortable. There are no combs. And this is what it looks like out the pack. Wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Looking good. Mm, mm. Ow. Hey. <laughs> no, but for real, y'all, we know. I know. I look dry, 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 dry. This video was so impromptu, I did not have any time to do, you know, anything to my face. I kind of just wanted to like show you guys the wig. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what it looks like on me after styling it just a little bit. I did go out later on, fluff it out a bit, um, and I'm gonna tell you about it. Here we go. Okay, guys. All right, so unfortunately, I'm dealing with a little bit of a tripod issue. So hopefully this stays still long enough for me to record this. Hey Royals, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Liz, aka Royal Beauty. And as you can see, I look a little different. I'm trying something new here with this really cute um, unit. It is a unit that was sent to me. I actually purchased it from Amazon, all right, in collaboration with this company who wanted me to try out one of their units. And I did get it off of Amazon. So I did the purchase. The way that they have things now when we review things, they ask us to, um, I've done this a couple times, they'll ask you, especially if they have Amazon, they'll ask you to purchase it so that I feel, I'm not sure if I'm right or wrong, but I feel it's to help alleviate the whole thing of them sending you a wig and you getting like one that's, made for you because you're reviewing because over the years youtubers influencers when we would get wigs and stuff for free and it's beauty supply stores and they send us wigs they don't have anything to do with the manufacturing of the wigs they're not the brand they're selling the wigs and the brand is a whole different entity so when it's the brand sending you the wigs then they're brand is on the line their name is on the line so they want you to give a good review and so a lot of times or bundles hair bundles weave a lot of times youtubers would get a lot of flack for getting product and like promoting hair because people would say that they're giving a good review because they got it for free um or they got a good batch of something because the company purposely sent them a good batch of something the sun is going down i'm really not even dressed for a review but i kind of wanted to do this because i literally just threw the wig on today styled it and went out with it so i just wanted to kind of give you like an out of the box look at this wig i might style it a little bit more i might do a beat face but the reason that i really like this wig was because it's so natural so i'm getting besides myself but yeah youtubers get a lot of flack for the fact that we'll purchase a wig i mean not purchase a wig we'll get these wigs or bundles of hair human hair and stuff like that from companies and if it's really really great for us but ends up not being great for somebody else that orders it they say that the reason why we got it so good was because of the fact that they wanted us to say good things. People, companies are now kind of deviating from sending us the batch straight off. Instead, they're encouraging us to purchase the item. So they will literally cash app or not cash app, PayPal, however you decide to, to work your the way that it happens, will send you the money um, and then you purchase the hair or the wig on Amazon so that you get you're you're purchasing as a customer and they have nothing to do with that particular purchase all you have to do is show proof that you did order it 
and that's it to confirm that okay we're working together and that's all they ask they could just send it to me but doing it this way helps so that i can give an authentic review if that makes sense that's what i feel correct me if i'm wrong i might be wrong I never asked them why they started doing that. That way I can tell you that this wig I ordered as a customer and when I ordered the wig, this is how it came. So um, let me grab the box, talk to you guys about it, show it to you. So it came in this really cute box here. And this box, like when I saw it, I was like, oh, it's so cute. And then, um, so the company's name is Yiru, Y-I-R-O-O, their logo or their their tag is your hair your crown now you know i'm living for that i love all things royal it shows you on amazon how to find them which is cute so you search yuru hair to find them on amazon they are on amazon and this is a human hair wig that i have on they have synthetic wigs as well and then on the back it gives you like facts and stuff it gives you facts on how to wash the wig how to maintain human hair wig shape the right way to measure wigs um I don't know why they would have it in there. Start from the head spin to, yeah, I don't know why they would have that. In there. Let me tell y'all really crazy. I, I honestly feel like I kind of manifested this one because I really wanted a wig like this that I could just wear in every day that matched and resembled my natural hair and or just like a fro that I could just throw on because I'm growing out my hair but then I keep wanting to cut it but then it's hot and it's cold like I wanted something I'm always on the go in the morning me and my best friend were constantly out after we drop off the kids we're like moving and just out and about and I really wanted something that wasn't gonna get in the way but I could still look cute and just throw on and she had has natural thick hair and she just throws in a pineapple and she could keep it going but as for you guys know I cut my hair so since I cut my hair it's shorter now and I literally have to do stuff to it to make it look cute and um, it's just in this weird awkward stage right now and I don't like it so I really wanted to have something that resembled my hair that I could just throw on this more natural and just do my makeup or do a light like what I did today and just kind of you know go with the flow so I decided to get a wig but I didn't even look them up yet I haven't found one come across one that I like that was this length in the beauty supply stores and I was like whatever I'll figure out or I'll create one and then this company hit me up to review this wig um, and asked if I wanted to try it out so I thought that was pretty crazy how I wanted a wig just like this and then it came right on time I was so excited on the back of it it didn't come with anything inside the box other than the wig that's all um, and that's pretty much it there's no instructions other than that there's no like stock card there's no other accessories anything like that I suggest that they put that in there it might be nice you know just a little extra stuff or a little extra something inside with the wig but it is the afro kinky curly short and this is a natural color wig it comes in it's six inches the hair is six inches and as you can see my light isn't on but as you can see like it's really it is really like kinky curly I love it and you can pick it out and make it bigger now I was hesitant to do that because I wanted to put it on my head and then like start messing with it for you guys so I really didn't do that much to it today because I didn't want to pick it out too much and then you guys see it after the fact and that it's not picked out and done up the way you know I know you guys like to see me like styling it I kind of want to also pick it pick it out because from the back this is what it looks like on the side and I feel like it just doesn't fit fit me yet and I need to like figure out that happy medium now I'm going to put the box down so we can kind of show you like how I've been messing with it now my hair is left out my hairline I left my hairline out because I really wanted it to blend and look natural it's very it's comfortable oh my gosh so comfortable I think the only con would be that it doesn't have a comb and because it's a full cap it's comfortable however it may slip off so I would suggest you add, add a comb if you want to buy a comb from Amazon or local beauty supply store and just sew one in to wherever you want if you like combs if you want to use combs and I would suggest if you're going to leave some of your hair out, just uh, create like a braid across the front and just put the comb combs into that braid only so that you can um, be secure and feel like it is secure. It's very comfortable, very like light. Turn around for you guys so you see the back. This is what the back looks like. I hope the lighting is okay because I'm really doing this impromptu. 
and you see I didn't really go ham on the front I left out my hair a little bit of my hair around the hairline just to make it look even more natural but I will show you guys what it looks like if you don't so this is what it looks like if you don't you it's not as appealing not in my book it's not I mean to each his own but I really feel like you'd want to leave out at least just just a little bit of your hairline you know just at least this and I have a widow's peak so whenever I don't leave out my widow's peak it's a hot mess honey it's not cute it's not pretty it just looks really fake I'm still honestly I'm not like okay in love with how I styled it yet I'm just in love with the potential once I do style my face style it style my face it's not giving me la 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 life but it is giving me natural vibes life I could throw this on and feel comfortable go out run my errands and not feel like I look crazy it is a natural color it didn't come in any other colors I do have to check I will check for you check the description box I will put it in there if there's other colors colors available but I believe the only color that was available was the natural color and then two like to like lighter than natural color I believe so there's nothing darker than that so it comes very kind of like brown and I know this looks super black but it's more like a 1b it's more like a 1b and for me, my, I love like my jet black, um, just for really natural styles. I don't know if that's just me. I like jet black. So that's the only thing that was not really a con, but just, I wish they had like black, black for me. You could do a lot with this. You could pull it back some, leave more hair out, do a little headband right here and just be super cute. Like you could really play this and nobody's going to check you about whether or not it's your hair. It looks so natural. Like I love it. I love it. Thanks so much to Yiru for Yiru. Hopefully I'm saying the name right. Thank you so much to Yiru for allowing me to review this wig. I will put in the description box a link if you would like to purchase um, and check out or check out the other ones that they have. They have other wigs. I really just like this one. They have other wigs, so check them out on Amazon. If you have any questions that I did not answer, please feel free to comment down in the comment section. I will be happy to answer them for you. You know I always respond. And if there's any questions or anything that you don't feel comfortable commenting down below, just DM me. I always answer my DMs on Instagram. So follow me at royal underscore B-E-A-U-T-E-E. -E, and I will be happy to respond to all your comments. Um, so yeah, and I'm also doing a lot of reaching out to people who would like help with their YouTube on my Instagram. So please feel free, like I said, follow me on there, DM me your questions, DM me anything that you want to talk about that you don't feel comfortable about on here, and I will reach back out to you. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. I will see you guys in the next video, which will be later on this week, so make sure you stay tuned by subscribing and hitting the notification bell so you don't miss my other uploads, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you guys so much. Stay royal. Bye. I just wanted to show you guys the lighting. Like, look how cute this is in different lighting. I should have stood here to do the video, honestly. I should have stood here to do the video, but it's okay. You guys can still see it. Yes. Yes, you guys, do not forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Watch another video. I'm going to post a couple of them right here for you guys. So make sure you check them out. Okay. And I'll see you guys in the next video.